morning, it's Thursday. I wanted to show you actually, because last night I was too tired to, the cool stuff that we picked up um, in the exhibit hall. I got this exclusive um, Game of Thrones bottle opener, shaped like the Hand of the Queen pin that Tyrion wears. So that was pretty cool. So I actually got two of these um, because we need a bottle opener, but also it looks cool. It might be a good gift. Um, and then I got a, this isn't exclusive or new or anything, this is volume 4, Serenity, Leaves on the Wind, um, featuring a few different things. Um, I'm sort of collecting these one at a time, that's my um, tradition for the last few years, is I'll pick up one of these um, compilation hardbound books um, from the Browncoats booth every year. Um, this is the last one that's out right now, but there's another one that's going to be released before the next Comic-Con. So that'll be good. And then um, our cousin Mitch got for us uh, some gifts because he's so sweet. He found this um, Harry Potter journal. It says H. Potter 07 uh, Seeker, I think. Does it say Seeker on there? It does. You can't really tell. Um, which is super cool. It comes with this really cool broom pen. So I just thought that was super sweet of him. Um, I haven't looked, it's probably lined, and I'll probably use it as like a long form journal or maybe notes for something specific. And then he also picked up this really cool metal water bottle with this little chibi Hermione and Crickshanks on it. It was just super cute, and I think I'm gonna actually clean this and bring this to use today instead of carrying around this plastic water bottles. Um, so that was yesterday, and today I'm going to show you what I have in my plan. So here's today. Um, this is what I'm planning to wear. And then we're going to head down there. Uh, it's about 7 right now. We're going to head down there in about an hour to get in to the convention center by 9 so that we can get in line for the Lego minifig drawing, which happens at 12.30. Um, there's three of us who are going to be kind of trading off in line because I know Gino's going to, to a panel at 11, but I might try to get to this panel at 10 because it sounded interesting. Um, but if not, no big. And then my brother and his girlfriend are coming down for lunch uh, at some time after that. And then these are just some sort of ideas. Um, this Peanuts panel sounded interesting. And then I was going to see if it's possible to like get into the back of Hall H like for the very last panel because sometimes people leave and you know not enough people are interested in the last panel and I like Chris Hardwick so that'd be cool but again obviously no big deal then we're having some friends come down for dinner as well um, we still have to sort of confirm the time and definitely the place and I probably will not get to any of these things that sounded interesting in the evening because we're gonna be at dinner but uh, that's the schedule for today, kind of a skeleton, and uh, mostly it's just going to be soaking in all of the excitement. trying to get in uh, and we are now in line for the Lego minifig drawing. We have a chance at a Lego minifig if we get through the line here that goes all the way up these stairs and then around to somewhere back that way. And uh, then we push a button and find out if we win a free Lego minifig. So we're just going to wait in line for a couple of hours because that is what Comic Con is all about. Mitch got one and I did not, but that was fine because we only wanted 
wanted to get, you know, one, and we managed to get two. So that was great. Uh, and then we went to lunch, uh, met my brother and his girlfriend at a Turkish place up the street. Um, I had shawarma, which was tasty. So after that, I saw that Hall H was just like you could walk in, there was no line. So I decided to go in and I caught a little bit of a Netflix panel for uh, a movie that they're shooting that's, uh, or that they finished. It's going to come out in December. It's called Bright. And it had Will Smith in it. The center of the story is, you know, my character war with, with uh, Joel's character. And Joel plays an, an, an orc. And his character is the first orc on the LAPD. So it just felt really great, you know, to be a, an African-American police officer that just found, you know, somebody else to be racist against. <laughs> so it was pretty cool to see him. And then I stuck around for the Nerdist panel because I'm a big fan of Chris Hardwick. Uh, listen, I am just as shocked as you that we, the Nerdist, are here in Hall H. I don't know how this happened. Uh, if you're waiting to see a Thor or uh, a Deadpool, uh, you will not. Uh, <laughs> And now it's almost six, and we're going to be meeting some friends, a whole bunch of people getting together down here for uh, for dinner. I'm from San Diego, so I have a bunch of friends from uh, North County. We're all going to get together and go to an Irish pub. dashboards inside my traveler's notebook. I thought that'd be really cool. So I've got these little travel postcards, London and Paris. These are by a uh, Laurelay Bove, I think. Laurelay Bove. Oh, she has an Etsy shop here. There you go. And then I got this one is double sided. So on this side it's got just an owl, a little owl. And then on the other side it's got one particular owl, well, delivering a Hogwarts letter to a certain someone. So I just thought that was really cool. And so these are going to go in, um, I'm going to get some of those Foxy Fix dashboards that you can en uh, insert things into and use those as dashboards in my planner. Good day, it was um, busy, and also we only got like a couple things done, but it was eventful still, and uh, man, it, it feels like the con is like almost over, but it's only just started. We have three more days to go, so many things still left to see and do, and uh, really looking forward to it. Again, we have another early morning tomorrow, so we're going to head home and try to get a little bit of sleep. So that's our day. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching my adventures on Thursday. Uh, we've got three more days of this, so we'll tune in again tomorrow and I'll be continuing to share everything. Thanks again. Bye.